Jason. What started as a fun night out celebrating my birthday quickly turned into a night I would never forget. It was the night I met you. Early on, I knew you were the one. I remember thinking, how could I feel so comfortable and at home with someone that I had just met? You love me unconditionally. You've shown me what true friendship is and what it's like to have a heart so full it feels it could burst. You give me perspective when I overcomplicate the small things. You ground me when I need it. You don't sweat the small stuff and remind me that I don't need to either. You are my soft place to land and you make me feel at home no matter where I am. You are the most kind-hearted, positive, caring and beautiful human I have ever met. Your smile lights up every room that you walk into. My favourite sound on this earth is the cackle that you make when you laugh uncontrollably. I love the way that you love Sophie and the way you look after her. I don't know how, but you have the ability to change my worst day into my best day. Jace, what an amazing man. Your love for my daughter is evident, mate, and I appreciate that. Brooke being your mum has been one of, and I said I'd never cry, I'm not, the biggest honours of my life <laughs> and most exceptional experiences you are spontaneously hilarious. I think all of us here today can see how happy Brooke and Jason make each other. We were just sitting at their house the other day around the fire and they were wearing matching sweaters and they were laughing to each other about things no one else understood. They get each other so well and we are so happy Brooke has found someone she loves and who loves her back just as much. In your presence. Brooke and Jason are one of those couples that just makes sense. You can see that they truly enjoy each other's company and the way Jason speaks about it is just so cringy. It's like he doesn't even remember I'm his special guy anymore. But I couldn't be happier with the person he's chosen to fill my shoes and I look forward to living in your basement like Jason promised me. Who love me like You hung around the Avery for a while and then you flew off with Jason and made your own nest up in Mount Evelyn. Today you've made it official. Welcome to the bird flock. To pronounce you to be husband and wife and you may kiss your bride. My beautiful wife, Brooke, you are my best friend, my therapist, my rock, my soulmate, my life, and now my wife. I love you so much. Would you please join me in raising a glass to Mrs. Bird? Oh.